The world's greatest systems do not survive by accident. They endure through structure, precision, and intelligence. At Nosley Tech School, learning is engineered the same way, where science, technology, and artificial intelligence work as one. Welcome to Nosley Tech School, where theory meets tomorrow. Let's begin. La Serenissima, the most serene. Venice is a fortress battling the osmotic pressure of a hypertonic lagoon that forces its way through every crack. She is a fortress of gates and pumps. Venice is a living architecture, a ligand navigating the fluid to find the receptor gate of survival. She survives by her core, a nucleus holding the genetic code to command the chaos. Surviving through selective permeability, knowing what to let in, and what to force out to maintain the balance within. The blood of the city is the matrix to the cell. Venice is a macro reflection of the living architecture that sustains us all. Biologist, yes? Sorry, I am completely lost. This city is a maze. Venice is not a maze, young man. It is a very complex organism. Follow me. Let me show you around the city. Look at that cart. Simple. Everything in one messy space. It works, though. It's efficient for selling gelato. Like a prokaryote. Bacteria. Simple, ancient, no internal structure. Now, let's go and take a look at my home. I have so much to show you in Venice. This city feels alive. Because it is. Venice breathes, adapts, and survives, just like a living cell. Inside, we have the kitchen, the library, the bedrooms, all specialized rooms with doors. Like organelles, the nucleus, the mitochondria? Exactly. This is a eukaryote. Complex life requires compartmentalization. Let's go into the living room. There's so much biology in Venice, everywhere you look. Because life leaves patterns, cities just make them visible. This door, it is the cell membrane. It decides what enters Venice. This living room is massive. Of course it is, but there is more to see. Let's get back to the city. Just like you said, this city truly has a life of its own. Look out there. The rain, the tourists, they drift where they want, from high concentration to low. Wow. But the water is different. It presses against the walls, trying to equalize the pressure of the sea against the city. And if we just let it happen, the city drowns. The cell bursts. It's gradually getting dark. Let's go back to my home. I have learned so much already, just in few hours. There's one more thing I need to show you. Wow, this is so massive. Yes, it is, but there is a biology process which I want you to see for yourself. Do you have pumps? That must cost a fortune to run. It requires massive energy, ATP. We are forcing the water out against its will. Active transport, using energy to move things against the flow. I have never seen pumps this massive. We have one more process to finish outside. Without it, Venice sinks. Without it, your cells die.
You see? A eukaryotic masterpiece surviving in a hostile environment. It's not a maze. It's highly regulated machinery. Come inside, Leo the biologist. Through the membrane, you are welcome here. Thanks. I think I finally understand this city. Venice survived by design. Cells survive by intelligence. And understanding comes when theory meets reality. Now step beyond the story. Watch the Nosley Tech School Lab Science video, where this film is broken down, tested, and mastered through real experiments and AI-powered insight. This is not the end. This is where true learning begins.